Herbo giveaway, dude. Ooh, wall's looking thin. We got a, we got six eighty eights, but only three. Not a lot of turbos left, man. So our winner for today is from Canada. Hey. <laughs> okay. Name's Hal. Hal from Canada. All right, dude. Hello. Hey, is this Hal? Yes. Hey, buddy. How you doing today? Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm calling about your car extended warranty. Oh, well, yeah? How many months do I have left? Well, it depends on what size turbo you pick, brother. What size turbo you want, brother? This is George and Jack Stan from the Cletus Channel. Hey, George, how are you? Good, man. Not as good as you, but... We love watching you guys. Thank you, so much. <laughs> Thank you man. You want a 76 or an 88? Uh, I think I'll take an 88. That a boy, dude. Going to Canada. All right, Hal. Thanks a lot, buddy. It's on the way. Thank you, guys. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. You're awesome, man. Thanks. Just like that, how gets dude. an 88 millimeter turbo? What a guy, speed. dude. I knew them Canadians knew what's he up. Knows what, he, he knows what's up. Give me the big one, eh? <laughs> <laughs> guys, couple days left. You better, you better we're get end of the month, stuff. guys. Don't forget, everything on the Cletus channel, every order, we're picking one random order every day for the rest of the month of May. And you get your shot at talking to one of us and winning a free turf This ski. is not a drill! <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Cletus McFarland YouTube channel. All right. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another McFarland Science episode. Jackson, tell the people what we got today. Nitro methane. Pure yeah. nitro. So this five gallon pail of nitro was $380. <laughs> that is what we pay for a 55 gallon drum of the normal fuel we race on. This stuff's not cheap, but it packs a punch. Nitro methane can make some power. 100% nitro in a five gallon pail. Don't really know what to do with it yet. I can tell you what we're gonna do with it. Yeah, what are we gonna do? Make this stock 5.3 run on nitro. Yeah, <laughs> we got a bone stock LS in a Silverado. You can see the truck was in a small accident. And minor. Nate was driving here today and he crashed it. Fuck my head and everything. Anyways, we are gonna try and run this thing on nitro. Now, nitro apparently does not mix with gasoline. Okay. So what we've done is we've converted our Silverado to run on methanol. A lot of guys mix alcohol and nitro, so we know that works. So we got this ghetto fuel system, runs down to this here bucket, but that's methanol. Pure alcohol basically. Dr. Tunamol here has tuned this here vehicle to run on methanol. Right now we're gonna make a dyno pull, see what it makes, and then we're gonna put some nitro in and see if it picks up a bunch of power. It tells us right here, and don't worry, professional use only, so you know oh, we're, we're in the right spot. <laughs> and luckily, we're professionals. We're doctors, so. so. Firing a hole. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. Got that foot going on in there. <laughs> Dang, man, you can really move that foot. All right, man, let this thing rip. Make a nice slick dyno pull. Second gear. We don't want to throw the drive shaft out of this thing. Oh, don't mind the wobble in that axle. That ain't no big deal. What do they call it? Not the baseline, but the, oh, control. Control run. The control rip. Oh, spicy. Oh, she still runs good. 287. 304. All right, 287 horsepower on the methanol, straight methanol. How much nitro do you want? Uh, Let's do like 20. 20% 20 nitro? 25, let's do 25. Okay. 25%, I got it. Yeah, yeah, let's do this. All right, George, we need about 20% nitro, okay? We got that much in there now. Yep. Yeah, oh, it's blue. Oh, no, it's clear. Oh, it's pretty clear, yeah. Ooh, it smells very nice. Going keep up going. to about the Home Depot sign, I think. Keep going. I'd say you're about eight percent. That's probably good about right 15. there. Fifteen. <laughs> about twenty. Okay, we might be about twenty-three percent. Twenty-three. All right. Or thirty. I would just add a lot of fuel and a lot of timing. Okay, you got nitro running through the veins of this paparuski right now. Let's see if we can get close here. Are you gonna add timing too? Cause I've heard um, nitro is big I, on having timing. Yes, but let's do with the 
let's just do fuel right now and get the fuel right, and then we'll add some time. Okay. I think it's gonna have no problem doing this. James, you think I'll have a problem doing this? James has no problem. George? Oh, that should be good. Huh? It's getting in, yeah. blending in. Ooh, it sounds like it's idling kind of low now. It, it, yeah, it'll start to kind of boom, 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 boom. get an exhaust shot back. Camming up. out. Yeah, so the horsepower was only 280, but he didn't rev it nearly as high because he had to bail. Oh, dude, look at the power across the board. The green is the second pull. I mean, you didn't rev it even close to what you did on the run I before. Just into it, yeah. Our first test run, pretty successful, but we couldn't rev it out all the way. So, same mixture, just added some fuel. Let's see if we can get through there. Pounds torque picked up 50 foot pounds of torque over the just methanol tune. You think it's still going lean up there? Yeah, it smells like nitro. Yeah, it fell off real hard. Uh, we have plenty of fuel, so I'm gonna put some timing in. I'll see what it Dude, put like 12 degrees. I'm gonna put four and we'll see if it Try eight. Do eight. Come on. Four. I mean, four is a big. If it, nah, dude, eight. Listen, if it needs timing, four is a huge. Like a huge game. Okay, all right. So if it doesn't you are the then. doctor time of timing. We're being so scientific. Okay, so we just added four degrees of timing. Same nitro, same amount of fuel. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it lost power. It lost power. Yeah, it, it was really ripping. It's, it's really happy let off the put, start. Let me put more fuel in it. Okay. See if that helps with the nitro. It's if we can get it to pull cleanly through 4,000, this thing's going to make insane power for 30% nitro. I mean, it's just on methanol making 300 wheel in second yeah. gear is insane. It's a bone stock 5.3. Yeah, but I mean, it's making almost 350 foot pounds of torque Yeah, at, at 3,800 RPM. Come on, baby. Hang in there. It's easy to pull cleanly through here. Holy crap! So at 4,000 RPM on just methanol, it was making 300 foot-pounds of torque. At 4,000 RPM with 30% nitro, it's making about 355 foot-pounds of torque. That's insane. That is crazy. All right, so you're just going to add fuel to the truck. We're going to leave the nitro mix the same? Yeah, I'm okay. going to leave everything the same. Just keep putting fuel till it like, <laughs> stops. Because I think it was just too lean and it was starting to spark. That is rowdy. That's insane. Nitro, baby! For an NA vehicle to pick just up fuel. 50 foot pounds of torque with just 30% nitro. More fuel. Things just keep going up around here. You got this, brother. Let it rip. Yeah, it smells like nitro in yeah. here. You could just leave, the, leave it rich and put more nitro in. Yeah, you want to just leave it that rich and we'll add some nitro? Leave All right. Nitro, Let me right? handle the nitro ratio on this one. I say she needs at least another 20%. Yeah, put the rest on it in well, there. <laughs> let's see. Okay, so that's not a lot of fuel, and we're at, what, a 70-30 mix, we think. Let me just... One, two, three, four... Five. That's <laughs> now we're still yeah. at seventy thirty. Six and a half. Seventy thirty. <laughs> the, the other, other way. way. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Here we go. Make sure you mix it up real good. 
What do you think, bud? <laughs> I think we're gonna pull up a five three today. Come on. <laughs> I think he's good. Oh my gosh, smells like straight nitro in here right now. <laughs> Dude, that's spicy. It smells pretty intense. spicy. That's through cats too. This still has cats on it. Oh yeah, yeah true. That's so even filtered exhaust. Oh right? yeah. It smells that strong. Dang. <laughs> this thing sounds freaking awesome now. <laughs> I've never heard a stock Silverado sound that good. Oh, dude, listen to this thing. This is a bone stock engine. It sounds freaking awesome. <laughs> it's getting... Oh, dude. It's burning my eyes. You better make this full. <laughs> dude. Oh, my God. You better make this pull before this thing blows up, dude. dude what is that? <laughs> it's the nitro. That's like, uh, <laughs> the cats out of it. Yeah, dude, it smells it's like... It's melting the catalytic converter. <laughs> Look at Nate panicking, dude. horsepower 414 foot pounds of torque okay so we went from 287 horsepower to 358 and then we went from 304 foot pounds of torque to 414 110 <laughs> foot pounds of torque and it still runs you know, you know what that means on a naturally aspirated you truck. Know what, that means? what? More time. And More time, and brother. Put it in there. What ratio do you think we're at realistically? Are we at 65, 35, 65% nitro? Yeah, it says all of it on there. Should we put <laughs> some more in it? I mean, we're here. Let's, let's see what just timing does, and then we'll just. Goodness the whole gracious. Thing. That, gonna make so five that is oh, insane. Five all right, doctor. You're doing great in there, by the way, man. Not an easy task to just tune a stock vehicle for nitro all right so we're about 65 percent nitro but now we got a little bit more timing how many degrees another four degrees all right golly brother 374 20 let's go You can hear how vicious this yeah. thing sounds. It sounds like a heads cam build. <laughs> but it makes more power than that. <laughs> <laughs> but it makes more power than a heads cam build and it's bone stock. In second gear. In second gear, that's the biggest thing. It, it makes a lot of power. Now that we're running this much nitro, it is burning it so fast. Yeah. How much fuel, fuel injector do we have left? We oh, can't have good, much. That's a good question. <laughs> I haven't checked. <laughs> Duty cycle, 210%. We are uh, 107% duty cycle. Okay, so oh, that's wide man. open. Just put it in, dude. All right. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to make this so it's like 90%. It's it. definitely going to be 90%. We're just going to lose fuel pressure. All right, that's got to be like 90%. Right yeah. Mid pull, I need you to throw a cup of fuel into the throttle body. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, brother. Dude, I love this. You ready? <laughs> I can tell. Nate's having a blast right now. He's going to be putting nitro in his car now. All right, let it rip. Come on, baby. Hold it in there. One more. Damn. Oh, my. Oh, my. That is unbelievable. Look at the torque. 445 horsepower, 489 foot pounds of torque. Brother, I am astonished. I am astonished right now. Dude, the percent gain is 55%. Look at the torque. Hold on, that's not it. Hold on. Look at this over the original run. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, dude. Original run, 
is horsepower here, torque here <laughs> with the nitro. That's your horsepower. That's your torque. Almost 500 foot pounds of torque. Dude, that's you know what that means? Brother. More timing. <laughs> you think? Yeah, you think you'll take it? I, I, why not? Why not? We might as well try. So we started at 287 horsepower. We are now at 445 horsepower. We started at 304 foot pounds of torque. We are now at 489 foot pounds of torque. It's with impressive. just fuel. I would have That's never impressive. guessed that. I would have never, never ever, guessed. ever thought this thing could make this much horsepower. <laughs> Naturally aspirate on nitro. 122% duty. <laughs> <laughs> the injectors are yeah, maxed out, dude. And those are 850 cc. This is blowing my mind. I thought it'd make a little bit more power. Did you think it could make that much I was, I was honestly thinking it'd be like 390, 400. I didn't think it would break 400. I didn't yeah, know we were no gonna shot. Go I mean, we're 445 horsepower in <laughs> second gear. That's insane. Dino Marlin dude, needs a pet yeah, for, for this man. next one, dude. <laughs> you could turbo your truck, or or you could buy a $400 pail of fuel. Yeah, I mean, honestly, and I run mean, for a minute. Injectors and then two pumps. Those pumps are 80 bucks a piece. Yep. Those injectors you can probably get for like $900 for a good set of 850s. That's insane. And then you just gotta buy really expensive fuel every time you run out. Yeah. Other than that, dude, you're good. Holy crap. What are we doing on this one? 90% nitro. Yeah, same, it's the same fuel. I put a little timing in it. And what I noticed on the last run was that towards the end of it, it actually maxed out the torque limits that I had set for torque management. And the so transmission? To, yeah, so it was pulling all the timing out <laughs> to try to keep it under six. It's like, damn. Yeah, so I maxed everything out, so nothing's gonna pull anything. We're just gonna go. We're just gonna see what happens. See what happens. I like it, dude. If it makes more than 445, that is insane. Listen to it, dude. It sounds awesome. All right, we got no safeties on. 90% nitro. Oh, brother. 457. 491 foot pounds of torque, dude. Picked up another 10 horsepower. Golly. All right, so you're at 457 horsepower, dude. Where did it peak at? Because right at 50, right at 5,000. Yeah, it peaked at 5,500. It peaked at 5,500. Well, you can see it rolling over real hard, too. That's where yeah. it's yanking the timing at. It, oh, Brother, that is unbelievable. That. So we have picked up 170 horsepower on just switching the fuel. <laughs> no other modifications. Just a fuel change, 170 horsepower. Yeah, that's insane. Well, that is there's only nuts. one thing left to do. Zach, it's making 107. It made 457 on nitro. 457. 457 in second gear. Dude, how much to run the stuff in the Tacoma? Yeah. All right, so Nate worked on a couple more items within the transmission tune. It was still pulling a little bit of timing. Let's see what it'll make. Still on 90% nitro. Dude, picked up another 20 foot pounds of torque, another 12 horsepower. I mean, when will it look, stop, every dude? Pull, look. 12 horsepower. Yeah, 12 every horsepower. single pull, it's just picking up power. Yeah, look out here. So, where it didn't dump all that timing, so that, oh. was, that was 41 degrees. <laughs> but where it didn't dump the timing out finally, it picked up big right here. This thing is insane. Like, if we could strap that in the bed somehow and make her rip in the parking lot. I bet lot. it'd be so fast. Dude, yeah, it'll just sit there and do donuts for days, I'm sure. So fresh empty There ain't here. no methanol now. It's just the Silverado <laughs> and some fresh nitro. Think that's enough? You better be safe inside. It's only $400 a barrel, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be rowdy. Literally just liquid money you poured out. I know. <laughs> That's like forty five dollars right there. I gotta be honest. I am impressed. Like I think it's worth it. Oh, one hundred percent. Like if your fuel can really pick up that much power, you could charge three hundred and eighty dollars for it. Doctor Tune them all, don't blow my truck up now. Yeah, at least I got the proper shirt on. If you yeah. ain't bending, you ain't sending. <laughs> there you go. All this fuel Here we go. Oh, it sounds so sick. Dude, that's what I don't understand. How does the truck sound this cool? The truck sounds so cool. It sounds like it has a cam. It kind of goes away after it runs for a minute. Careful now. <laughs> the first time I 
It did make 295 foot pounds of torque. Oh, oh, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Battery died. Hey, what a success, dude. Dude, we need more injector. That's what we, we need, need more injector. Is it spark knocking because it's so lean? Yes. That is the most mind boggling thing because I thought I've always had, you know, good fuel, methanol, that good stuff, which is great fuel. Yes. But to be able to nearly double your horsepower by just changing the fuel, no turbos, nitrous, or anything is the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. Air and fuel, that's all you need with nitro. Yeah, that is nuts. It's like boost in a bottle. So <laughs> the stoichiometric ratio for gasoline is yeah. like 14.68. To one. Yes. That's the perfect that burn ratio. Is 1.7 to one. <laughs> oh, so you need a lot more fuel yes. system. Yeah. Hey, overall huge success. Thank you, Dr. Tunamall. What do you boys think? Should we oh, run some nitro success. and some stuff? I have an idea for the next try. <laughs> All right, well, we'll be back. We'll try this again. Huge success running some nitro through the Silverado on the old Dynocom today. I don't know what we will do next with this. I mean, I am just so astonished that it was able to do this, but we ran out of fuel system, so we can't go any further. But we will be back, and we will figure out something else to use nitro on. But that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Do it for Dale. We'll freaking see you later.